Yeah, yeah, so we have Jen versus Syrup. <laughs> uh, do these two play in win? I don't think so, unless Syrup beat them. I don't know who put Jen into losers. I don't think so because I think that I think that Jen got put into losers by Jen got put into losers by, by Jackal. Jackal, yep. So it was Ling Ling who knocked Syrup into losers. Oh yes, you so, are right. So right now Syrup is he wants that run back. He wants the chance to take out Ling Ling and stay alive in this tournament. Meanwhile, Jen over here, I mean, he's just going to do what he always does, which yeah. is friggin' play to win. Yeah, no, this is the defense on who can be Jersey. We got two Jersey members still alive and one sitting in Winterside Grands. Trying to defend the house here. And Jen, technically the only New Yorker. To That's defend. true, yeah. To defend. Yo, we should get a system for, like, putting state flags on players for stream. Yo, you hear that? Honestly, Z Zeno should start doing that. That'd be fun. That would be a little cute thing. Especially for, like, monthlies when you have a lot of more out-of-region yeah. uh, region players. I don't even then want again, my... what the heck is the Connecticut flag? Yeah, I don't know. I don't even want the New, I don't even know like, the New York flag is. Is it just, like, a is. glass of dirty tap water? I don't even... <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I'm thinking, I'm looking at the New York flag, and I'm like, yo, this is like a pair of Tim's. <laughs> a pair of Tim's in a fitted. <laughs> and, and just a chopped cheese sandwich. Yeah. And just like a fitted on the, the fit is on the chopped cheese. <laughs> with like, and it's with just, a pair of Tim's. Yeah, it has a pair of Tim's. Like, it's like, what up, bro? <laughs> Can we petition Albany to just stain, change our state flag to what we all know it really is? <laughs> like, was that not the state flag already? <laughs> One of you guys oh, have Photoshop in the, in the chat. Make it for us <laughs> real quick. Oh, man. Oh, no, That's got to be the theme of the next New York PR. Yeah. Oh, I'll, I'll help you guys out. <laughs> Just remind me. All right, getting to this actual game that is in progress. Jen's kind of been on the back foot ever since, uh, you know, that 3-2-1 start. But not the end of the world for him. You know, 48% on Syrup. There's about 50% separating them. But he's the one sitting at death percent right now. And Ness has such consistent kill power. Like, Ness F tilt kills. Like, every single move. Come on. Ness up tilt. Ness, Ness down tilt leads into a kill move. Ness up air, neutral air, back air, grab. See, up uh, tilt. Why does up I forgot that up tilt also kills. <laughs> It is giving you guys stuff. Why does Ness up tilt combo at low percents and kill at high percents? I don't know. It's unfair. Then again, I'm pretty sure Palo has similar stuff at the disposal. Nair. <laughs> oh, God. Nair doesn't kill so much anymore. Okay, Bear going to take it. And not only combos if you DI in. He's dead. He's alive. No. He's extremely alive. Yeah, you're a liar. Listen, I, I just, I assume. Yeah. I doubt and now it you made an ass out of me and you. No, just me. Don't worry. Oh, okay. If anything, okay. the fact that you didn't say anything meant that it was implied that you knew I was wrong. Oh. All right, that's well, take it right there. When I said he's dead, it was actually, I was looking 30 seconds into the future. Oh, yeah. I forgot. You have um, that Shulk ability to see in the future. Oh yeah, no, I was gifted with the cursed with the gift of prophecy by yeah. Apollo. <laughs> you also got your top player now. You got what was it? Foresight with oh, yeah. It's like, yeah, no. I, I'm not worrying about this. Alright, but things looking pretty solid for Syrup in that game one. I wonder what adjustments Jen is gonna have to make when we get to game two here. Yeah, I don't know. I felt I, like it felt like he was, wasn't was beating out Ness Aerials, which I know that's easier said than done, but, I mean, if there's a character to do it, Palu's definitely one of them. I don't know. Palu definitely is the character to do it. And it's crazy because I think last time PK Chris fought um, Jen, he won, so I do see, like, Syrup able to take it. PK Chris was supposed to end up coming today, but I ended up bailing. Said something about being one of the best two people are too scrubby to play me yeah. my bear not gonna take it yeah that's a good air dodge because not only do you dodge the bear but you also get yourself closer to the ledge with ness's disgustingly long directional air dodge yeah. it's disgusting 
All right, and this seems to be the theme of today is game one, one player looks very dominant, and then game two, that dominance is just flipped on its head because Jen taking that first stock after only taking about 38% himself. He's looking absolutely uh, like he figured out what he needs to be doing, just pressuring Syrup in the corner, not letting him get any of his, you know, I'm going to hit buttons type neutral started. And as a result, you know, I mean, right now, actually, it feels like, never mind. Got hit by up air. You're done. It's over. <laughs> GG's. Good DI from Syrup, though. He's not getting hit by a lot of these uh, down throw mix-ups. Oh. I'm so sur I don't know why I'm surprised Knight catches. But I eh. mean, correct me if I'm wrong, but it's basically... Oh, oh my god. Oh, he's alive. It um, doesn't matter. We, we cut the clip right there. We, we got what we needed. Yeah. But I mean, I am I wrong in assuming that mess like up smash at the ledge like that is basically RNG? No. Well, because you, you are wrong technically, but you are. I understand how well, you feel. Because it's like it, it basically it has to two frame, right? And there are blanks in between the hitbox. Yeah. You know, it's like you know, it's a multi hit, so there are like little breaths in between, and you're not going to be timing it for well, the actual up smash. There's no blanks in between that. That's true. If anything, it's just like one. It lasts forever. Oh. Okay, this is actually big damage coming out. Seraph already taking about 32%. That neutral is not enough to do it, but no jump. Forced to recover right to the ledge. Actually finds it, but 141% has not found his way back to neutral. Nair. Can you take it? I love that Nair because he was running right at him. Jen was so scared of the grab because back throw at that point would kill. And that's consistently. He's just not going for the grab. He's instead punishing the, the, the drop shield. Yeah, okay. All right, we saw the dash throw. Oh, let's see here. Able to chase him down, but Ness doesn't quite have the speed to really keep that combo going. Jen, though, at a 63%. No, doesn't have to be worried about too much, whereas Syrup right now, I mean, a hard read here could kill him. I am, God, the fact that Ness's directional air dodge has such displacement means that Jen can't really go for some hard read with, like, an up smash or a down oh. smash. <laughs> he dead? Oh, my, no, but maybe. <laughs> yeah, just barely, though. All right, able to air dodge up. Yeah, this does Palo have like a solid way to like consistently edge guard Ness if he's uh, you know doing his up B? Oh, back throw? I don't know if it's gonna do it. Yeah, not quite enough. If he was a little bit close to the ledge, maybe. But now he has to find another hit. Is the F tilt enough? The F tilt will do it, and yeah. we have Jen taking game two, keeping things even at a one-one uh, score count. Yeah, no, that was kind of crazy. I actually thought like Syrup end up getting the momentum back at the end, and I thought it would be like just carry him to the victory. But what's cool about this is, like, because Syrup had that momentum, you can see him ride that, even though he lost the game, ride that into game three. Definitely. And that, I think that really depends on whether Jen is going to let that momentum keep going, because having a game break means that you can recollect yourself and do what you need to in order to stop yeah. that sort of thing from escalating past your control. Yeah. And it's, it's better when they take a longer break in between those games, but... Sometimes it just doesn't work out. You do see, we do see Jen starting off kind of strong, get with those nair loops, and okay, and now it's syrup mode. Oh, that was really good. Saved his jumps so that he could actually get that up air off of the uh, the little dinking from the down smash, and as a result, all of this advantage has been generated. Syrup at eighty percent, but a little bit of an overextension means that Jen is now the one who finds himself off stage. Yeah. Can he get past the ledge? Oh, they're just trading it back and forth. Yeah, and I'm surprised Syrup doesn't um, side magnet the PK, or not the PK Thunder, but Bear is going to take it right there, but the Explosive Flames, just to, like, heal up and, like, deter Jen from doing it all stage. The thing is that it does put him much further down where he has to recover, and I think he's maybe nervous about that. Yeah, but, but Jen hasn't been going, other than the one time he did, he really hasn't gone all stage. All right, Jen, he's getting hit by that uh, that charging that charging hitbox on the ledge, but he's not dying. 
Granted, eventually he's put off stage, and there's only the, you know the, the forward error is inevitable. Yeah, it's like the, it's like the Thanos of the Smash. Yeah, <laughs> best forward error, just yeah. I am inevitable. Wow. All right, got a bit of neutral interactions going back and forth. And Jen just trying to keep Sarah into the corner. All right, I, I love when Jen does that. You know, he he start faking like it doesn't. He doesn't do a game one often, but throughout the set, he was just start um, short hopping into then to Tomahawk grabbing people, because then you, you start expecting aerials or where he would normally bear and stuff. All right, Jen, only at 80%. Ah, but that percentage is growing, and he needs to find a way to kill Syrup, whereas Syrup has been, you know, pretty com comfortably, like, rolling around, not really getting punished for things. Up smash. Not going to take it right there. Oh, that back air, it connected, though. And in the end, the back throw is not enough. I can't believe it. Jen just barely surviving. He can't take another one of those for sure. Next hit here probably takes oh. it. And what? Wait, 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 wait. Falling okay. up air? Point your finger to the sky? I also saw the beginning frames of I think that was up tilt from Jen. So I actually didn't know who got the kill right yeah. there. Life's an illusion. Salty. Oh, man. All of this damage. Yeah, Jen was really looking for that kill. And even then with the dash attack, it's not enough. Oh, tried to call him. Finally takes it, but 71%. It's the, here's the thing. If he takes another, like, 40, he's at death percent for so many of Ness's options. Oh, no, certainly. Maybe. That's not even counting any hard read that Ness might, uh, that Sir might take here. Yeah, but this is Jen's turn now. Oh, and the neutral air damage. The win box, will it actually be meaningful? Uh, it, it, was, it was kind of, but Jen wasn't able to close it out. Back throw not going to close it out here. I'm curious that he staled that back throw. That might end up, I mean, who knows? It might cost him. Yeah. I can't believe that hit. <laughs> Untackable. Wow, yeah, you saw the red sparks from it. He released it, I think, right? Yes. He released it to catch the two frame. That's impressive. Yeah, that's so messed up. Oh, the, the, little, the little nest square up. <laughs> the young man's like, you're my hood now. Own it. <laughs> All right, moving into game. This is game four right now. Yes. Syrup takes this game here. That's it. He gets his chance to face off. We're going to have a New Jersey Grand Finals. Oh, oh no. wait. No, no, no. Sorry. He faces we against... He faces uh, Ling Ling. Faces Ling Ling first. Correct. Encore regular. <laughs> yep. So, Encore claims him. That's true. We might end up with the, uh, the standard Encore Losers Finals. Yeah. Let's see. So far, a good start for Jen, but as I say that, oh my god, oh, what oh. the heck? Why did I say anything? You weren't supposed to say anything. I, so I, you, you're, li you're literally commentator cursing this kid. Uh, Syrup looking real good right now. I can't see a way where he can lose this game. <laughs> it knows when you're faking. Dang it. <laughs> All right, but no, Syrup actually in a bad position. But that barely spacing that forward, uh, outspacing that forward air means he gets back down to the ground. Means he might be able to get a whole bunch of damage. Let's see how it goes. And you were oh. talking about that side magnet, and there yeah. you see it. Finally, coming out game four. And see, that technically saved his life right there because he would have been in percent for the near and now able to fight another day. And let's trap in. Jen, oh my gosh. Oh, I'm interesting that he went for the down throw. I mean, if he had gone that two frame, that would have been absolute curtains. But uh, nonetheless, oh, oh it's hey, curtains hey, regardless. Hey, it's curtains for someone. And cut. 
Yeah, oh. All right, that's not going to be taking it, but now we have two stocks to one. This is looking very grim for the sole New York representative left here alive in the uh, Encore bracket. Yeah, all Gen fans, raise your hands in the sky. You're trying to get a New York dub. Oh, your, your hands are not raised high enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, finally managing to get that hit in. Going to go for up air into up air into up air. Oh, we air dodged, but wasn't there to actually punish it. He yeah. gave too much space. Oh! Hands in the sky. All right. I mean, that's if he's going to be making a comeback, that's how it begins. But at the same time, Syrup does have the lead, and I think for the most part, still has the momentum. Yeah. That back air almost killing out right, but Jen just barely alive. It's going to get lost off stage once more. 123%. There are so many things, especially at the corner, that can kill him right here. But, as you have said, it's his turn now. 64 off stage. If he can get some big hit here, an F tilt, but he gets his jump back, meaning that this is going to be a lot harder to actually. Yep. Sarah back on stage. All right. Yeah, counter hit. Going to close it out. Yeah, that's the sort of thing where when you have somebody at the ledge, it's great for you, but there's also that risk where if they.